CNN France News. Right now we just got a report that the child abusers, Elena, Cole, and Soledad Marquez, has arrived in Paris from Plotagon City. We will go live with Maiden Alec here who's at front of the courthouse, the Lady Justice de Paris, can you hear me Joaquin? Yes, I can hear you. Here is the front courthouse justice of Paris, France. As you can see, the child abusers has arrived from Plotagon City. They will head in court in their times. You people better let us go right now. You can't do this to us. We mean it. Wait, what? Are you seeing what I'm saying? Those people. Yeah. They're angry at us. This can't be. Come on, you three. Let's get in the court. Oh my god, they are cheering on me. Since the child abused, it is good innocent he will heading to the courthouse and explain to his parents what they found guilty. That's the end of the line. Let's go Dora, it's time with your parents so they'd explain your judges anyway how to felt it guilty. Great, can't wait those people for teaching my parents a lesson. Now we will go on live event of the trial of Elena, Cole, Soledad Marquez. Inside play to Justice de Paris. Life event begging now. Court is now a session. So we are going in the record in Matarog People versus Elena, Cole, and Soledad Marquez, who are convicted of giving their daughter a punishment days 12 times in a row, abusing her so badly and murdered her many times. Elena, Cole, and Soledad Marquez, do you realize how much damage you've done to your toddler's life? And you almost about to chain was her by giving her 11th punishment days. Luckily the police here stop you in time. You even gave her the worst birthday gift by giving her a punishment day. Brutally and injuring her 24-7. Murdered her a few times. But luckily Plotagon logic always brought her back to life. Destruction her room few times. Like, what is wrong with you people? Do you have anything to say for this? For you information, Dora is the worst author and everyone we could have. She always caused trouble and caused destruction to your Plotagon city. She deserves to have a punishment day. I agree with my wife. She's nothing but a troublemaker, and she deserves to be punished big time, and she also deserves to die. I agree with my daughter and son-in-law. She even get revenge on us and ruining our life. She doesn't deserve that life on this earth. Mom, Dad, and Abuela. Do you realize how much you put me through? I am getting tired of you grounding me and giving me a punishment day non-stop. And I had to get revenge on you because how the way you treated me like a slave and punching bag. You are the worst parent I ever had, you gave away my freedom and punished. Shut up Dora. You brought this to yourself. You don't ever talk to us like that, if you dare speak to us that way again, me, your father and your grandma will. Shut the hell up Elena. Your daughter has a right point about you. Don't even think about giving your daughter punishment day, cause you're in handcuffs. You have no remorse at all, you should realize that this is child abuse. And how badly you treated her and punished her way to the extreme. You and your husband and your mother should be very ashamed of yourselves. Excuse me your honor? Yes, inspector. 
the officers have found, and brought the other criminals who had used Dora here, is Amber Christina, Dora's teacher, Mr. Cherry, Dora's principal, Dora's classmates, Gab, Kevin, and Gina Delgado along with her mother. The officers are already bringing them here to court right now. Good. Oh my god, please tell me this is true. What, don't tell us that they? Hey, get your hands off of this right now. You better let us go at once, you can't do this to us. <laughs> Elena, Cole, and Soldad. Um, hi Mrs. Christina, Mr. Cherry, Mrs. Dugador, Gina, Gab, and Kevin. It seems they arrest and brought you to. And Elena, what's going on? And I see Dora right next to the judge. Gina, these people are giving angry stares at us, all of us. Oh God, they are really angry at us. I really feel like something is wrong. I feel so scared. Oh boy, this is really making me uncomfortable and scared. Well, well, well. Looks like we got more criminals who abused Dora Marquez in my court. Hey, who are you to call us criminals? Dora a criminal and should be in jail and... Shut the hell up, Mrs. Delgado. You are criminals cause you abused Dora and involved in her punishment day. Now that you child abusers are here, let's continue with the session. Amber Christina, you are convicted of abusing Dora being a struck teacher also involved her punishment day twice. What do you have to say for yourself? Well, Dora is my worst student in my class. She never pay attention and cause trouble in my class and ruining Gina's life. Not only that, she petrified me almost a year ago in May. She also licked me in her dirty imagination. She deserved to have a punishment day and I helped her parents with her punishment and deserved to have the worst birthday ever. There is no excuse to do that to your student. And I believe why she petrified you, because how the way you treated her and give her a lot of hard tests. You should be ashamed you should realize that teachers cannot have used their students like that. You are a horrible excuse of a teacher, Amber. Hey, you don't speak to her like that. Who do you think you are? You should be. Shut your mouth, Mr. Cherry. I'm the judge here. And you are also convicted of abuse, Dora. Allow child abuse at your school involved in her punishment day on her birthday. What do you have to say for this matter? Well, our last child abuse, Beckhouse bad students need to teach a lesson. And Dora is my worst student in my school. She also licked me as well and put a bomb to the volcano science. She deserved to get a punishment day and I helped her parents for her birthday punishment to teach her a lesson for being the worst student in my school. Bullshit. You should rails that allowing child abuse at your school is very illegal. Not only that, you and Amber cut Dora's eyes out with a knife. You and Amber should realize that this is murder. And people won't see without your eyes. You are, seriously, a terrible excuse of a principal Mr. Cherry. Next. Gina Delgado, you are convicted of assault psychological abuse, and involved Dora's birthday punishment day. What do you have to say for yourself, young lady? Dora is my worst classmate and my worst enemy ever. She brought the detriment to school and killed me and caused Chasso. She deserves to be punished for trying to ruin my life. And she deserves to have punishment day on her birthday, and I help her parents for her punishment, so I teach her a lesson for what she done to me. Says the one who tried to ruin Dora's life. You've been snitching on her and you tried to stop Dora trying to stop his mother calling Caillou's father and killed. You should be very ashamed of yourself. And you should have mind your own business. Young snitching lady. Hey, you hurt my daughter's feeling and made her cry. Who do you think you are? I didn't say you can talk Mrs. Delgado. And also, you are convicted of child abuse and involved Dora's birthday punishment day. What do you have to say for yourself for this? Well, I'm not sorry for what I did to Dora. She keeps ruining my dog there's life. She's been bullying, harassing, and hurting my daughter. So I help her parents for her punishment. She deserves that on her birthday for what she's done to my lovely daughter. Well, your daughter is the one who is running Dora's life. You heard what I said to her. If she doesn't snick on Dora and mine in her own business, then this wouldn't have happened, you also hit Dora with a spike block in her birthday punishment day. 
do you realize that's child abuse? Shame on you. Gab, you are convicted of assault, psychological abuse, and involved Doris Birthday Punishment Day. What do you have to say for yourself, Missy? I honestly don't care what I've done to Dora. She keep bullying my BFF Gina and ruining her life. She even hurt my feelings at school. I also helped her and Dora's parents for her her birthday punishment day. She deserved it that for what she's done to my BFF and me. Like I already said to your friend and her mother. If she mind your own business and hasn't snitched on Dora, this wouldn't have happened. That only you and your friend did to her. You and your friend use an actual driller and street of hair drill to drill Dora's hair to cause her blood to come out. That was very insane of you to do that. You two ought to be ashamed and last but not least. Kevin, you are also convicted of assault, psychological abuse, and involve Dora's birthday punishment day. What do you say for yourself, young man? Fine. I admit, I helped Dora's parents along with my classmates, my teacher, the principal, and one of my classmates' mother in her birthday punishment day. And I helped them by beating her up with a spike bat, destroying her room with gasoline with fire. After all that, I asked the three down to hit Dora for her punishment. I did all that because how the way Dora has done and causing trouble around at school. Kevin, are you serious right now? We can't believe you did all that to Dora along with her parents, the principal, your teacher, and classmates along with your classmates' mother. Yeah. What is the matter with you? We did not raise you that way. Do you realize that's child abuse? We cannot believe you did all that. Just you wait until you are found guilty. Your parents are right. You should be very ashamed of yourself. So, how do you all plead? Not guilty, your honor. I agree with my wife, not guilty. I agree with my daughter and son-in-law, not guilty. Not guilty. I plead not guilty. I seriously plead not guilty. I plead not guilty, I'm begging you. I agree with my BFF, not guilty. Well, I plead guilty. Well, we have one plead guilty, but the rest of you plead not guilty. I don't believe this. So, I call James EJ VGCP and Stephanie EJ, come to the stand please. Thank you your honor. So, you must be the parents of Dora Marquez, you think is funny, huh? You and I cannot believe what you did to my daughter, you giving him a punishment date a lot extremely. You and your wife and the other criminal should be shamed to yourself. I agree James EJ my wife, Elena. Do you realize you're me your daughter? That's very disgusting of videos. Cola and soul dad Marquez, I can't believe what you did this year daughter non-stop. Because you posted an ugly community aims. You three are now guilty for what you done to your daughter. That's it your honor. I'm finished. Thank you James EJ VGCP and Stephanie EJ. Next, I will call secondly Gavin. Come to the stand please. Thank you very much your honor. So, you must be Elena, Cole, and Soledad Marquez. I cannot believe you would torture your daughter like that. Seriously, what is matter with you people? You parents are insane, even more insane Elena, you saw your daughter's hand off. That was very gory of you to do that. She literally had to suffer badly. I declared you and the rest are guilty, that's all. Thank you Leia Gavin for your time. Now I call, Iris, Oriana, Talia, Lina, and Carissa of the Lalir Ock, come up to the stand. Thank you, but this may be loud. So you're Elena Collins, you see that I'm furious of you for abusing your daughter 24-7. Do you realize how much your daughter suffer from you? You kept abusing her non-stop. I agree Iris. Cole, you run over and hit your daughter with the motor seal and badly injured. She nearly died because of your insane punishment. You, your wife, and your mother a huge disgrace. Oriana is right, you've been treating that she's worse than Hitler. You have no rights to do that to your daughter. That is very cruel and child abuse. Your daughter eating candy that has lethal poisoning on it but killed her. What you did is called murder. Talia is right, Lucally Plotagon logic brings her back to life. Yeah. I agree Lena. Because of that, my girlfriend and I declared you along with the other people are guilty. Big time. I hope you pay your parents get executed for this. We're done. Thank you for your scolding and your time. Them in the loyal rock. Alright, I call to Stephanie Gavin. Come to the stand please. Thanks your honor, I will get so loud. 
Do you see that I am furious? You and your wife, I can't believe you guys be your daughter. Do you think realize this is child abuse? Not only with that, he is the worst birthday punishment day and God suffer his life. Elena. I saw what you were doing, doing that is called murder and you were making an ugly videos on community, and this is Cole, and Soledad Marquez, you embarrassing to your daughter like that? You also helped the neighbor Dora and her parents to make grounded, and ashamed to yourselves, you two are guilty for what you've done to your daughter. That's it your honor, I'm finished. Thank you Stephanie Gavin. And lastly, I call to Caillou, Rosie, Doris, and Boris, the parents Anderson to the stand. Thank you your honor. So you must be the family of Dora Marquez, we are very angry at you for child abuse torture, and assaulting your daughter a lot. You guys have poor parenting skills. I'm serious, even a lot, worse you along with your sister and brother nephew, insanely electric your daughter by letting her explode. That was, seriously, just very insane of you guys to do that just insane. Caillou is right, you're just psychopaths. You've been treating her like a punching bag and she is so young to be abused like that. I agree mom. You even forced your daughter to eat rocks. Are you kidding me? Rocks are not meant for eating and that could cause an infection of damaged organs on her and she could have had a heart attack because of you. Rosie is right. As for that, we declare that you and the other people paying you are guilty of charger I hope this will teach you. That's all we have to say theme your honor. Boris, Doris, Caillou and Rosie, thank you for your time. Now, since Kevin already pleaded himself guilty, what does the jury and everyone including Doris find Elena, Cole, so lauded, Amber Christina, Mr. Cherry, Gina Delgado, and her mother, and could find. Guilty. 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 Right. Kevin, for assaulting and help Dora's parents for Dora's birthday punishment day. You are sentenced to 10 years in juvenile detention center at Club de Jacobins. Oh no! What have I done? Now my parents are going to be furious at me when they see me in juvie. Oh yeah Kevin, we will be seeing you and Julie when they take you there. Gab, for assaulting drilling Dora's hair and help Dora's parents for Dora's birthday punishment day. You are sentenced to 15 years where Kevin will be at. No, that's not fair. Dora deserves all the now my life is ruined. Why? Gina Delgado, for assaulting drilling Dora's hair made Dora's life a living hell for Snitch and others on her. And helped Dora's parents for Dora's birthday punishment day. You are sentenced to 25 years where Kevin and your friend Gab will be at. After you and your friend turned 18, you will be moved to Los Santa prison. What? You can't do this to me. That is the longest sentence ever. Why can't Dora be sentenced? This is not fair. Now Mount Life is officially ruined for a very long time. Why? What? You can't do this to my daughter like that. She is far too young to be sentenced for 25 years like this. Shut up Mrs. Delgado. For child abuse and help Dora's parents for Dora's birthday punishment day. You were sentenced to 50 years in Flory Morodi's prison. Are you serious? 50 years, for Ida Dora. But that's not fair. That is a very long sentence. I won't live that long there. Too bad. Life isn't fair. If you hadn't helped Dora's parents for Dora's birthday punishment day, this wouldn't have happened. This is for your lesson for what you have done. Amber Christina, because you've been abusing and treating your student, and a strict teacher, you are permanently removed from your job as a teacher. And Mr. Cherry, for allowing child abuse at your school abuse of power, and abusing and treating one of your student. You are also permanently removed from your job as the principal. And for psychological abuse, cutting Dora's eyes off, and child abuse, you both are sentenced to life in prison. What, life, but you can't do that. I've been working as a teacher since 2011. You can't give my life away. And I've been working as the principal ever since 2015. You can't take away my life like that. Michael other Alan and might have you aren't cooking going to be mad at me. I heard that your Alan Cook's brother and Warren Cook's uncle, according to one of troublemaking hosting a slumber party videos. I heard that in one of Alexander Wormster's video. But anyways, too bad. This is what you two get for what the freak you've done to your student. 
You will never work as the teacher, principal ever again since you're spending life behind bars. And finally, Elena, Cole, and Soledad Marquez. For psychological abuse, murder, assault, torture, destruction extreme child abuse, and other more. And including by giving her 12 punishment days, in a row and almost giving her 11th punishment day. You three are sentenced to death in the electric chair. Your execution is scheduled on June 17, 2024 until the next few days and... Hey, Your Honor. Um, what is it, Dora? Instead of executing my parents on June 17th this year, I have a perfect idea for them. Oh, what's your idea, Dora? I would like to request that we should give my parents a... Punishment Day. What? No. Dora, how could you, Your Honor? Please don't accept my daughter's request. Wow! Dora, that sounds like a great idea. Yes. Because this will my revenge and a payback for my parents giving me a punishment day non-stop. I will decide it how many punishment and think of the perfect one we'll give them. After we're done with the punishment, we will execute them on the electric chair for tomorrow so I have time to think of the worst punishments for my parents. Please, we're begging you, please don't accept my daughter request. Just executed us on June 17th. Please. Oh, you have a great point about this. Your request is... Don't you dare accept. Accepted. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. We don't want to have a punishment day. Well, guess what, Elena? You, your husband, and your mother will be scheduled to have a punishment day until 8 o'clock in the morning. No! Stop! I can't do this to uncle and a dog, Elena. Please don't give my siblings and my mother a punishment day. You can't do this to them. Shut the hell up, you two. Police. Take these people away. Please don't take us to prison. Please. Please. Let us go right now, we don't want to go to prison. All right, anyways, you will be staying in friend's prison until tomorrow at 8 o'clock in the morning. And when it's time, you will be getting a punishment day by every townsfolk including your daughter. After your punishment dad is done, you will be executed in the electric chair. Police, get those child abusers out of my court. You can't do this to us. This can't be happening. Court dismissed. Life event of the trial of Elena, Cole, and Soledad at Marquez is now over. They will be getting a punishment day tomorrow at 8 o'clock in the morning after their punishments. They will be getting executed in the electric chair. If you want to join and help Dora giving her parents a punishment day, sign up at the police station. At ends until 10 p.m. Anyways, we will go on a commercial break. Stay tuned for more GNN France news.